Let's take a look and see whether BRF5 is an ionic or covalent compound. So the first thing we want to look at, find bromine on the periodic table, that's right here, and then fluorine, that's right here. And they're both nonmetals. So when we have two nonmetals, we're pretty sure we're going to have a covalent compound, also called a molecular compound. But let's take a look at the electronegativity just to be sure. So here's bromine, 2.96. Here's fluorine, 3.98. So 3.98 minus 2.96, that's a difference of 1.02. So that's the difference in electronegativity between the bromine and the fluorine. Let's see what that means. So on our scale here, 1.02, that would be right about here. So based on the fact that we have two nonmetals bonded together and the electronegativity difference is less than 1.7. Some scales use 2.0. BRF5 is a covalent compound. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.